Goblin six swings at Kyle with a modded seventeen. Crap. So he's gonna do uh, four total damage. Kind of close, guys. All right. Torin, it is your turn. Sweet. I'm going to try to charge at the wolf to get him away from, uh, what's his knuckles? Brave. Okay. So, I need you, I need you to make, let's say, a strength attack. Strength attack. Yeah. Um, you, efficiency to it. Um, and I, I'm looking at the rules for grappling. Okay. Uh, that's spell casting. Cover melee attack, opportunity attacks, two weapon fighting, grappling. Use the attack action to make a special melee attack. Um... Okay, so, oh, it's an athletics check. It is an um, athletics check? Yes. Awesome. I think and I'm... And then I, as the wolf, will make... Jeez, that's a three. So, yeah. Um, plus two. Okay. So, what did you roll? Uh, I rolled a uh, 21. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, um, you grapple the creature. You are able to move with the creature at half movement speed. Sweet. Yeah, I'm going to drag him off of Brave. <laughs> and okay. uh, hopefully, like, not let this guy blue. Lead out, you know, I can't do anything about okay. that right now. Uh, where are you taking him? Um, I'm kind of taking him down towards the fire pit. Okay. Like, so there is a goblin that is still there. Oh, there is a goblin still there. Yeah, that's the red um, circle. How 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 uh heavy would you say this wolf is? He's gonna chuck him. It is. It's a medium creature. It's probably. He... Upwards of 90 pounds. Do you think I could uh, swing it at the goblin? Oh, man. Um, okay, let's see here. How, how creative do I want to be? <laughs> that would be... Because how heavy is a great axe? How heavy is a great axe? Yeah, uh, it it your weapon that you have to swing with two hands is twelve pounds. Oh gosh! <laughs> no, it's not. Yes, it is. That's bull. Um. So I'm going to say, oh man. Because I, I kind of want to see how this works. Um, Can I roll for it? Okay. Roll roll me percentile. And at an 80 or above, you are allowed to swing it with just a huge surge of adrenaline. Okay. I'm, I'm rolling it. You're not going to believe it. <laughs> oh, man. I, All right. I got 100. <laughs> Holy cow. Okay. Um, roll at double disadvantage. Roll three d20s and give me the least of all three. The least? Yeah. Double disadvantage. Which isn't a real thing, but I'm making it up. <laughs> uh, Alright, so the least is 12. Okay. That is not going to hit but I will say that you are able to swing the wolf just 
Do you want me to add my strength to it? No. no. Okay. <laughs> um, so I will say that you are able to swing it and kind of toss it, uh, th- throwing it prone to the space that is behind the other goblin. Okay. Yeah. Sweet. So is is that to the left of the goblin then? Yeah, uh, yeah, to the left of it on the map. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure it didn't um, land in the which... fire because I was gonna say like um. <laughs> I was yeah. seriously aiming for it. <laughs> I know you were. I know. It would have done, I think, a d six of burning damage. Oh, the fire. Yeah. Um. Let's That's see fun. Yeah, one d six like of a... fire damage that, to any creature that falls prone there. You want to call it like a d four or d six for throwing? No for bludgeoning damage, I guess. Nope. Oh, no damage done. No damage done, but you successfully moved the wolf off of uh, Brave. Brave, oh, make a death cool. saving throw. Ten. Ah! Oh, 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 that is a success. You do not bleed out. Oh, is that just barely a success? Yeah, that yes. is just barely a success. Holy Eight. shit. Okay, so oh, does that, that doesn't mean he gets back up there, right? That just means he's not no. dead. No, he that's does not just bleed one out. success. I am, like, okay. super close to death, Kelso. If the roll is ten or higher, you succeed. So. Oh, uh, thank God. <laughs> okay. Actually, let me let me rephrase, let me rephrase my question. He's still down, right? Or is he actually like yes. back yeah, up? Yeah, one he's health? he's still down. Okay, just checking. Um, so it is now Aerie's turn, and Aerie, seeing that the wolf is no longer atop of Brave, he's going to literally just like dive off of the stairs. He's going to fall prone, just diving to spare the dying on you. Yeah, get it. Um, which then, because he can't end his turn same tile as you, he's going to move to the tile uh, left of you. That would be um, right north of where Ripper presently is. Mm-hmm. So you are now stable. You are still at zero hit points, but you are no longer being out. You're able. You you can now erase your death saves. Um, Dude, I was clenching okay. real hard for you. <laughs> like, if I could I kill this dice... goblin, I would have come to help you. I swear, but I just he won't. I can't hit him. Okay, um, Goblin Four with his battle axe is going to make a swing at. Uh, He's kind of got his Sildar. That's there. his name. Yeah, Sildar. I'm guessing. Yeah. But he does not hit, yeah. Uh, Which makes it Kyle's turn. I'm going to, once again, swing at this ugly-ass goblin in front of me. And maybe, (laughs) just maybe I can chop off its face this time. Just one can hope. I rolled an... mm, God damn. (laughs) I rolled a nine again. Oh, Oh. my gosh. (laughs) Wait, you get plus six on that, Nope, that was my plus. Oh. Wait, plus six. Sorry, that's an eleven, but it's still not a hit. Yeah, that still doesn't hit. No. I keep rolling the five. Loser. All right. Offhanding. Um. Um. Uh. uh offhand, I guess. Okay, that's an eleven, natural. So. Does not which hit. Which sucks because it like. It paused on a nine, uh, a nineteen, and then it slid and landed on eleven. It's like, oh. oh. <laughs> okay, Sildar's turn, and he's gonna make a swing at Goblet Four. And that's a three, and that is a fifteen. So he hits with his second swing, which is gonna be one d eight plus one. Eight, hooray! So that's a total of. Which kills Goblin. Okay. 
Um, Ripper's turn. Ripper is going to jump onto the spot that uh, the goblin was just killed on, and he doesn't realize that the one that he bit earlier is not dead anymore. So he's going to make the attack at Sildar. That's a 16, which is a modded 20. So that hits, and he is going to take 2d4 plus 2. One of those is leaning. Now there's a total of 9 damage. Oh, Sildar's not doing too hot either. He's not dead, he's not dying. But he is unwell. Okay, and Sildar has to make... Stray, 11... A, he succeeds. Cool. Goblin 6, swinging at Kyle. That is a modded 14. Yeah, suck it. Suck it, you take damage? No. I wouldn't say suck it if I took damage. No, I, oh. I have a 15. I have a 15. Nice. Good. Okay, Torin. <laughs> Yo. You're up. Uh, so... Uh, is that goblin still alive? No. Well, okay. the one next to the one next to Cody is. I'm I'm fairly close to it, and aren't I? Yeah. I mean, okay. Sildar's kind of in the way, but. I you can, can I just like it. can I just jog over to that goblin and take care of it for him? Because I just like. Try. I can see him struggling over I'm there. Just, yeah, they're I'm just like swinging back and forth. So Swords are clanging. Okay, Dude, yeah, this goblin is—he knows some freaking tricks, man. I mean, this is you this see ain't some no normal tricks? goblin. <laughs> He's honestly right, more of an issue than Cragmar was. Clark, yeah, yeah, Clark, yeah, that that thing, yeah. Clark had the potential to be much more problematic, but you guys, uh, well, Brave did a number. On his health, uh, twenty three to hit with my battle axe. Yeah, that's uh, that's a hit. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> and it's dead. He's like just extremely close to dead. All... I just couldn't get the last hit on him. Yeah, he had one hit point left. He oh mm, mother. <laughs> and <laughs> how many I, uh, rounds heal was him that? For twenty points. <laughs> for twenty points. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I just right, like cancel everything and just healing word him. No. Do you have I, healing word? I, 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 no. I what? uh I do like six damage to him, which is I rolled a one. <laughs> oh, okay. He's negative four. Okay. It's uh, dead. Goblin yeah, Goblin Six is dead. So that just leaves Ripper. Sweet. I'm going to use the rest of my movement if I have it to run over Ripper. Okay. Um, Sildar is in the way, but you can move. If you went just, up and around. I'm just going to fucking him. deck him. Just, just don't, punch don't him. Don't punch straight. Sildar. <laughs> no, well, no you, if, you he get, if he went you don't to have tile attack, south so. and then he's going up and left, wouldn't that be the full 30 right there? Yeah. That'd yeah, but I have 30. 25. Then you don't oh, have an fine. issue reaching him. Or okay. you could go. Or if you want oh, to go around. It took you 10 to get to where you are. So then that would be a total of 20 there. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to move there in this turn if you went that way. But it's 10, 15, 25. You could make it most of the way either way you went. Okay. Well, I guess just forget it. <laughs> okay. Uh, in that case, it is now uh, Brave's turn is passed because he is unconscious, but not dying. Aerie is going to cast Sacred Flame. Wait, what? Uh, don't I still make a saving throw? Or no? No, not no. Bleeding anymore. You, you have been stabilized. Oh, I have been stabilized. Yeah, you're not bleeding anymore. Yeah. You're not. All right. Oh, you're not sacred. Alert uh, what's happening? You're knocked out. Yeah. Sacred flame on that wolf. The wolf up, oh, or wolf rolled in that twenty. The sacred flame. So the sacred flame just kind of like falls just all around it and does literally nothing. So, uh, 
Goblin 4 is dead, so I can erase him from the initiative order. Kyle, your turn. All right. Since that ugly-ass thing is finally dead because and the angry dwarf three. came uh -huh. and said, fuck you, <laughs> I'm going to move past uh, Sildar, and I'm just going to start trying to wail on that ugly-ass mutt since Ares right there and I get advantage. Um, just explain to me where you are going because Sildar is still in between you and the wolf. And right. then don't I just can I just space... move into the empty tile south of Brave? Like I just that would just cause me fifteen movement, that, wouldn't it? That is where Ripper is. Oh, I thought Ripper was still. I thought Ripper was to the was down and left. No. He he moved into that spot because that goblin died and has been attacking at Sildar since then. That explains that. Okay, I am sorry. Um, in which case, that would be 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. You 25. wouldn't quite make it either way. Well, no, if, if I went around, that would be 35, which if I use dash, I could reach. Oh, that's fair. And you can dash as a bonus action. Mm-hmm. So, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. 35 would put me to the left of it. Yep. So, what I'm going to do say? that. Okay. Uh, since he's still next to him, that means I still get my uh, advantage. Right. Yeah, plus you're behind it, which would give you flanking. Right. So, I have advantage and sneak attack, right? Yeah. Okay. So, I'm going to roll for attack. 15 and 11, which would put me at 19. No, 21. 21. So I, that's, that's a yeah, hit. Yeah, that hits. And I'm going to start rolling for some damages. You better buy yourself some flex six. tape, boys. Five. Nope, nope. Hey, come back. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm going to roll these other six. Five. So that's 10. 13 plus the 4 is 17 damage. It is dead. How dead is it? Negative 7. Negative 7. All right. I just I just stab it repeatedly cuz I was really pissed that I couldn't hit the other yeah. fucking goblin. So I'm just stabbing it in the like in the back, like the oh, meat God. of the top of his hide. I'm just I'm just stabbing oh, him God. repeatedly. <laughs> Well after Do it's it. dead, because I'm just kind of bloodthirsty at this point. I don't know it's dead yet. And I'm, I'm going to guess that Torin's going to say something. <laughs> I'm, All right. I, I am definitely thinking about saying something. So you are going to be two of these plus ten. I'm rolling loot now, sorry. Okay. Eventually, like... Eventually, I notice that it's dead, and I yeah. sheath my sword. Okay. Oh, shit. I gotta find where I did that D6 land. I didn't realize you liked me so much. D6 land. What? <laughs> Kyle, wait. What? What? I didn't realize you liked me so much, Kyle, that you'd stab a goblin repeatedly after I'm revived. I... I... <laughs> Is it a goblin? I thought it was, a, like, a wolf. Or it's wolf, a wolf, whatever. Okay. Same difference. Making sure I'm not retarded. Yeah. I'm sorry. Just got. Just got to make sure. Did he have anything to say on? Did he have anything to say on that? What it will say? He's talking to Marcy. Oh, I, that sounded like super like he was talking to you. I yeah. legit can't find that D6. Yeah. Apparently, I already picked up the D6. All right then. I <laughs> guess I am retarded. <laughs> okay. So, any uh, any good loot? Okay, um, so there are six goblins, numbered one through six, and then there's Clark. Uh, Ripper has no loot. Understandable. Okay. Um, so... Shall we pull them all together and see what we've got then, guys? Sure. Uh, oh, God, for that one. You're still unconscious, Brave. You have no say. Oh. <laughs> well, damn. Just, just leave the money we leave for him on his... I'll hold on to his okay. money. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so, 
What's in the big red box? Okay. So pooled together, all of their loot that I rolled for is worth 53 gold pieces. Ooh. Wow. All right. That is three, 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 four, yeah. eight, six, and 26. Nice. All right. That Were is items or anything, or is it straight up gold? gold each. That is all in gold pouches that the goblins were carrying. Um, besides that, they're all wearing leather armor. The goblin number three that had the scimitar has a shield. Um, there is one hand axe, two short swords, one scimitar, one battle axe, one short bow. Clark has a morning star and four javelins. Um, he had five, but one of them is still sticking in Brave's arm. <laughs> I forgot about that. Um, <laughs> remind me what a scimitar is. A scimitar is just like a, a scimitar curved sword. Oh, it's that. Okay, sorry. I'm. I was thinking like the, a think scythe. Arabian Nights. No, I know. I was thinking scythe, but that's called something else. Yeah, it's called a scythe. Yeah, it's like... well, th there's another name for it, but I don't remember what it a is. A sickle. Uh, sickle. Uh, yeah. There's, there's like a there's, weapon. There's a big difference. There's a weapon variant a of it that I'm thinking of, and I can't remember what it's called. Yeah, a sickle. All right, what, whatever. Yeah. Just never mind. The vicious sickle. Thickle. Either way, they're still it's armed. A thickle. Yeah, the thickle. You're a thickle, thickle. Mike Tyson's gonna thickle himself on you with a thickle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um. Hashtag farmer life. So besides <laughs> that, in the crates that are in the room. Um. There are several that are marked um, for like uh, for delivery at a store uh, named Barthens Provisions, um, and I mean it doesn't take any any real looking. Clark is pretty proud of his treasure chest. It contains six hundred copper pieces, one hundred and ten silver pieces. Two potions of healing and a jade statuette of a frog with tiny golden orbs for eyes. The frog statuette is small enough to fit in a pocket or pouch. The frog's mine. I want the frog. You're <laughs> well. You're not dead, but <laughs> I'm Jesus. close to death. <laughs> you're not okay, awake. Corn's gonna, uh, Corn's gonna go over and uh, pick up the frog and just like examine it. Okay. Oh, I lied about which store they were going to. Uh, Lion Shield Coster is what they're marked for. Sorry, I looked at the wrong the wrong shop. So, what is a Morning Star? Um, it's much like a mace, but it is spiky. Oh, okay. Um, I don't want it then. No, it's more like an oversized name. Say that again. It's more it like a what? It doesn't have. It. It's got five to, like, eight blades sticking out of a center handle. Uh, and it's, it's like a oversized shuriken. Wait, I, I thought the Morning Star was uh, the one thing that's on a handle that's attached to a chain. And then it has... I mean, that I didn't come to tell that's you. That's a flail. I came to say oh. hi. If you, if you that, like, open you the link, you knew, I guess so I, I just didn't you. copy the... Image, my, my reason for coming was to see not tell you but if you click on the link there's a it's, more well there's a version with a chain and there's a version where it's straight okay. attached to the handle oh uh, it's just a a main. flail is the one that oh. in general there's a morning star flail. and then there's a flail version of it yeah okay yeah okay, okay. yeah so a morning star sense. is basically a rod with a spiky bit yeah like a mace but spike, but not chain. Okay. Huh. Yeah. Um, Certainly. Um, and and the the star that he's using is of wood construction. The 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 spikes are more like nails that have been driven through the wooden end. So it's kind of like a baseball a, bat. A very crude. Okay. Ugh, yeah. Gross. Um. Okay. So six hundred copper, one hundred ten silver. And a jade statue out of a frog with tiny golden orbs for eyes. So, Kelso, I I did some math. Um, we can give uh, 
uh, you and me 18 and Colton 17 gold just to split it up evenly. And since he was almost dead, I figured yes. whatever. So we'll leave that up to you guys. I'm perfectly fine with giving him more or whatever. But uh, then we can split up the rest of it, however. Okay. Um, What's the... So 110 silver and 600 copper. What's the... Well, yeah. uh, Copper silver. Ten copper. Ratio. Ten copper to a silver. Ten silver to a gold. That means a, that it would. That's what I thought. A, a grand total of like six gold pieces, and out of the copper, and then eleven gold pieces out of the silver. Yeah, that makes sense. But it sounds much less impressive that way. Yeah. No, I know. I just wanted to double check. Um, Plus, I've been giving you guys gold for loot out the wazoo. <laughs> you have. Uh, wrong with that. Well, if we, uh, if we bring, God, if we bring Brave one of the healing potions, will that perk him right up, even though he's unconscious? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yeah, you kind of have to shove it down his mouth, but whatever. Uh, I mean, Ari, Ari's a life cleric. Be. Would it be yeah, more of a potion? Let's not waste the potions. Okay, whatever you want to do. I just want to double check. I was actually going to ask yeah. if Aerie would be able to enhance them or anything of the like. No. Um. Okay, so Hyling, Torrin, I'm going to say divvy up between you and myself. Um, one, because I could probably use one at some point, uh, since I tend to be right in front of everyone since... You know, adjacency bonus and stuff and then you're the tank so it's nice to give the tank a healing potion i think that makes yep, sense i'm all about it um uh, yeah the the gold and then uh the 600 copper 110 silver we could just split those all evenly across the board to 200 apiece for the copper uh let's see what's that well 40 40 30 yeah. <laughs> I didn't think it was that funny, though. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so 40, 40, 30, and I'm assuming we're giving Colton the 17 and the 30. Yeah. Um, Not to, like, be hateful to him, but... <laughs> he, he's unconscious. He doesn't get yes, a say. Marcy, I, I, I am. I mean, at least we're giving him this much. I mean, for all he knows, we could have just said, oh, yeah, there was 20 gold in there. Here, We decided to give it all to you. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, what are we wanting to do? Copper pieces? Uh, 200 apiece for the copper. That's just yes. straight across the board. Um, you and okay. I get healing. Over. And did you, uh, did you want the Morning Star? I'm not going to grab it. Yes. Uh, no, I don't want it. Okay. So that's that, 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 and that. Um, can can we inspect the frog? And see if there's anything significant about yeah. it. I mean, it's in a chest. Could have been because it was shiny, but could have been because other reasons. You can. All right. What do you want me to roll for? Well, what are you trying to figure out about it? Um. I, I guess that would be a better question. Uh, can I Arcana check it? Yeah, you how, can. How high is your Arcana check? Uh, it's not great. What but, actually? You know. What is Arcana check? What would that be under? Checking it for magic. Arcana is intelligence. Sorry, there, Arcana. It's right there. Sorry, couldn't find it. I only have a plus two. Yeah, I have that. a plus one to it. Uh, that would be a thirteen. Um, as far as you can tell, there is nothing special about Chewat. Okay. Um, it's just a frog. I'm going to. Yeah. Uh, he checked for magic, which I I'm not gonna check for history because that's not how that works. <laughs> um. I'm not really sure what I should check for. Medic. How does 
Medic! You're fine, Colton. <laughs> I have one HP! I'm and pretty I sure Ari's healing man. over you in the background somewhere. We're just not paying attention to him. We kind of tend to do that after a fight. We just ignore him for a while. If you haven't <laughs> We noticed. always ignore Ari. <laughs> we really do. Um... I, I I don't I in what would investigation what would the difference between that be what would that or is that not the right thing to check that uh if I, I were mean, to investigate. as far as far as um as far as anybody can tell it is nothing special okay because I I rolled a twenty one. So, for investigation. For investigation, I I asked and then I rolled it just to see what it would turn up. Um, investigating it proves it to be a very pretty, very ornate um, figurine. Um, somebody, whoever made it, took a lot of care and love to create it. Huh? Um, but there is nothing in particular about it. Um, because of that check, would I be able to guess what it would fetch for? Um, it would fetch. You cut out. I didn't know if he was looking pieces. it up or if he cut out. Forty gold pieces. That's not forty. Bad. That's not bad. That's pretty nice. So I'm going to, since I'm thinking aloud, I'm going to say, I would say that probably goes for around 40 gold if we were to sell it, Torin. Yeah. What do you uh, think? I think we should probably... We could uh, hold on to it for a while, um, see what's in the next town. Maybe someone might be interested or it might come up in a conversation. Yeah. I'll let you, po I'll have you pocket that for now. Yeah, I'll, I can hold on to it. Okay, so... That is everything divvied up, because nobody wants that piece of crap weapon. <laughs> um, so out of all, okay, so that's what was all that was in the chest. Um, can I look around in all of the crates and stuff, since that's been salvaged from people they highway robbed? For sure, that's not the um, Let's see here. Let me see if there's anything. Yeah. Um. This doesn't say anything about what is. It. Um. It says that the symbol is. A blue lion, the symbol of the Lion Shield Coster, a merchant company with a warehouse and trading post in yeah. Pandalin. Or sorry, uh, Elderfell. Um, so probably not a whole lot of you to you. Hmm. So there's nothing interesting in there then. No. Okay. Um. Shout well. Uh, can Ari still heal him even though he doesn't have any spells? Because it's a cantrip, nope. right? Nope. All right. Um, he has used one hundred percent of his healing. So okay. Uh, do we know if that's like are are there any other chunks of goblins around? The, I I can't ask that. Um. Uh, how should I phrase you, that? You so. You specifically, because of your say that again. You, you notice cut you cut out. You specific, you specifically, because of your ability to memorize the terrain that you go through. You see the top part of the chimney from the beginning of the dungeon. I knew it. Or the the beginning of the hideout um, on the western end of this room, and due to your I mean, your your general thoroughness. You can be you can be pretty certain that there are not any more goblins. Okay. 
Um, I'm going to share that information. Yeah. Okay. And I'm going to ask, remind me, were we able to fit through that or do we need to go? Yes. Around? Okay. We would be able to fit. And we killed the one on the bridge. So that's, that's yep. definitely everyone. You nuked him. We, I, I, I did. I don't know what happened, but yes. I did. Um, cool. So if we just leave without healing brave, he, he, we might encounter something and he might die in, in the route. So should we give him a healing potion? Torin, you dead? Um, I mean, <laughs> yes. Fuck, let me read from the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> well, well then, if you feel that way about it. <laughs> Instant death, I just a rock <laughs> fell on me. <laughs> well, shit, I guess it's time for the Lord's Prayer. <laughs> <laughs> All righty then. <laughs> uh, he's he's gonna well, drop some prayer on you now, boys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do you wanna do you wanna give him yours? Do you wanna do you wanna Rochambeau? <laughs> I'm I'm Torin. Hello. What? Do you wanna give him your hey. healing potion, or do you want me to give mine, or do you wanna play me for it? Is Aerie not healing us? Aerie can't do anything. Aerie's kind of tapped out. Okay, then we should probably take a short rest. I don't think you heal for a short rest. I think you have to take a long rest. You can uh, heal for a short rest. Yeah, you have you hit dice. Yeah. Oh, that, I, okay, for some reason I, I thought hit dice was for long rest. I, sorry, not sure. What nope. That. Long rest is total restoration. That's, um, that's right. Short rest is hit dice. Um. Okay, I have ten health points, so I'm gonna need to rest too. Otherwise, I would suggest taking a watch. Um, I I feel like Ari and Sildard, I think, are like a short. Health. A short rest is no. Sildar is nowhere near full health. How much? Um, how much did you lose? <laughs> Bless you. Yeah. He is at three out of twenty-seven. I realized I think that might have been Will that sneezed. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I, it thought was, it was I thought it was cold in her again. I couldn't tell. Who? Um Oh yeah. So I would say um, we could take a long so rest, a, a but I'm not a sure. Short if to rest. To a short rest. Let's see here. Let me let me find it in my table of contents here. Uh, adventuring rest six. One of these six resting. Um, a short rest is a period of downtime at least during which a character does nothing more strenuous than eating, drinking, reading, and tending to wounds. A character can spend one or more hit dice at the end of rest. Yeah. Characters pit yeah. um, the player rolls the die and adds the character's constitution modifier to it. So you do not have to sleep or anything, and it can only, it can be as short as one hour. Okay. Um, I have a question. So for you, were, you mentioned the other night, um, out of session, you were talking about uh, long rests and watches and stuff. Yes. Um. So if a long rest is eight hours, do you necessarily have to sleep for those eight hours, or do you just have to be at rest? Um, you have to sleep, or you, you can. You have to be doing non-strenuous activity, such as taking a watch or something. Um, so taking a no watch doesn't than... count against a long rest, right? No. Okay. Because you can do things uh, up to I think two hours, which is like taking a watch. Usually, you split it. In Four, four watches. Um, let me let me flip back to page one eighty six here. Do you guys? While he's looking for that, do you guys want to take a long rest? Well, you guys being torn. 
Because, okay. I mean, Sildar could definitely use it, and we could yeah. all use the heal. So, uh, yeah, a character sleeps for at least six hours and performs no more than two hours of light activity, such as reading, talking, if the rest is interrupted by a period of strenuous activity, like uh, at least one hour of walking, fighting, casting spells, or similar adventuring activity, the character must begin the rest again to gain any benefit. Mm. So, that, so you can have a fight in the middle of a long rest as long as the fight does not extend past one hour. Makes sense. Which would be ridiculous because it's ten turns to one minute. Yeah. So then that would be that would be sixty turns to an hour. Yeah, which you, would be you just can't go for a minute. Hell right. of a f right. <laughs> oh, that was a movie title. I just oh, just caught that. Yeah. Um, so, so do you guys think long rest? And then we could just do a two-hour shift. Torin. Yeah, long rest sounds good. Are you me. alive over there, man? I think yeah, he's falling he asleep. Is. Are you falling asleep on us, man? I'm I'm kind of falling asleep. Do you? Should, yeah, do you, this would also be. I think this would be a good good time to stop. Do you want to call yeah, it okay. a long rest and call it, guys? Yeah. Um, you are able to rest peacefully throughout all eight hours. There, the, the cave is now safe. It has been totally cleared. Um, and at this point, they are not sending anybody here. So, uh, yeah. So you guys can refresh your hit points, refresh your actions, all of that jazz. Noise. Noise. Alrighty. Okay. And no, we do not level up this time. <laughs> All right. That's not it. That's, uh, that's, so is that it for you guys? Luna's guitar. I don't know why that's. Yeah. Uh... I think so. Right. It's going to need to be it for me pretty soon. Like, if, if anybody wants to be up and chat about anything, um, we can do that. But. I'm trying to go to bed by 10 every night. Understandable, considering what you're doing. No. All right, we yep. will end the recording. The shadow with the